Chris, what's up guys? Your boy Chris Sue Walsh Walker here. What's up guys? It's your boy Chris Sue Walsh Walker. Today, I'm going to do something that is going to be silly, but why not? Today, I'm going to be taking an omnidextrous test. Uh, being omnidextrous is pretty much simple. It's being able to be fully skilled to do the same task on your right hand as well as your left hand or vice versa. Um, so I'm going to do a lot of um, drawing. Um, as you can see, I'm going to use uh, the same drawing. I'm going to write one with my right hand and the other one with my left hand. Now, um, truthfully, I just want to see myself if I really am omnidextrous or if I'm not. Um, I was born being right-handed, but maybe, just maybe, I have a talent to where I'm one of the few people in the world that can do the same on the right as well as the left. So, um, I did, I'm going to do a lot of random shapes, random words, I'm going to do some cursive, it's going to look silly, or it could be looking pretty good. Now I'm doing this on the spot. So, y'all here with me. So, I'm not going to fool y'all. I'm not going to cheese on nothing. I know it's late at night, but I got bored and I just want to do something. So, here we go. Alright. First thing is we're going to make a triangle. Okay. Alright, I'm going to use my dominant hand to start, and that's the right hand. Alright. Here we go. Let's make a triangle. Alright, right hand, I'm going to make a triangle, boom, there it is, there's my triangle on the right side. Left side, alright, here we go, I'm going to make a triangle, I'm going to make a triangle with my left hand, it's not bad. Alright, so, uh, triangle, bam, right hand, left hand, alright. Number two, we're going to spell the word stop. All right. Spell the word stop. All right, right hand. Also, Stella's here with me. Thank you, thank you, Stella, for being a part of our silliness. All right, so this is my dominant hand, which is the right hand. That's spelled stop. I, I oh, it's actually the right way. Right here. Yeah, so it's stop. All right, left hand. Spell stop. No problem. There we go. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. All right. This is my left hand spelling the word stop. All right. Next, in our omnidextrous test, we are going to draw a stick figure. Okay. Stick figure. No problem. Alright. A stick figure. Alright, this should be fun. Also, Stella's in the background, as y'all can see. A stick figure. Mm-hmm. My dominant hand. There's my little cute little stick figure. Left hand, do a stick figure. All right, here we go. Mm-hmm. Yep. I mean, it's not bad, I guess. But there it is. There's my stick. There's my stick figure on both left and right. All right, number four. All right, write your first name in cursive. All right, getting a little tricky now. My first name is Chris. So here we go. Bam, and I wrote my first name in cursive. Now I gotta do it with the left hand. Alright. 
Just so y'all know, my mother is left-handed. She is the only left-handed person in our entire family. But maybe I could be the first on the dangerous one. There we go. Go do 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 put the age uh, make sure you put your little I mean, that's not bad. That's not really that bad. If y'all can see that. Yep, it's not completely bad. The S looks the S and the I kinda messed up. I did my best. All right, next one. Draw an octagon and a square. Draw an octagon and then draw the square around the octagon. Okay, number five. Draw a square, I'm gonna draw an octagon and then draw a square around the octagon. All right, so from, I've been out of high school for nine oh, for nine years now. So, um, thank you, Stella, for giving me some encouragement. I really appreciate that encouragement. Now, if you don't mind, get two of your paws off of my little box. I can draw. Thank you, Stella. Thank you. Yes, yes, Dad. Dad can try. All right, here we go. So, so sad. That's gonna take me a minute to draw. Alright. Draw an octagon. And then draw a square around the octagon. Okay. So that's my octagon and the square around the octagon. Okay. Now the left hand. Yes, there's some difference, but there's my left side octagon with the square in the middle, with the square around it. Okay. Number six. Finish, write a complete sentence in print saying the words, I love you, and then your name at the end. Okay. Alright. I love you, Chris. Alright. Well, there's my. There's my I love you, Chris, with my right hand. Now I gotta do the same thing with my left hand. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, I don't know if y'all see that, but there it is. I love you, Chris. Left handed. All right. Number seven. Draw, and the last one, draw a house 
brawly house with the sun and some clouds and put some windows on it. Okay. Alright. So, and then, okay, so. There's my sun. There's my house. We're just gonna put a driveway. There. Or the walkway, whatever. Okay. Alright. Put some windows. Okay. Put a little circle window. And then put some clouds. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna put a little chimney right there. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Alright. So, that's the right hand side, right here. I, I pretty much did the basics and told me. Now I gotta copy that on the left side using my left hand. <laughs> Alright. I don't know how left hand people write. It's so weird. I mean, they're some of the smartest people on the planet according to a study. 10 to 20% of the world's population is left handed. They have to be more creative because we live in a right hand world. Alright. Anywho. Alright. Let me. I mean, oh, I got the door. Okay. Alright, so there's my house on the left hand. There's all my tested up done. Right there, you have to see it right there, the armadextrous test. So, the goal of being armadextrous is supposed to look the same on the left as it on the right, and clearly. I don't think I do too bad, but it's safe to say that I am not ambidextrous. I think I'm just right-handed. Um, so that's just the writing portion of ambidextriness, and clearly I am not ambidextrous. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I will continue to make more videos like this, not the ambidextrous videos, but other things. Um, I thought it was something pretty cool for me to take a written ambidextrous test and see if I was pretty good at it. But no, I, I mean as much as as much how good it does kind of look on both sides. I think I'm at, I spent 27 years being right-handed. I think I'm just going to keep it that way to the time I'm in the grave. So, um, hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you put in the comments, likes, whatever. Or just look at it and just keep going with your day. Whatever it may be, all I gotta say is, deuces, stay fresh.